Ever wondered why some people seem to struggle with exchange-traded funds or ETFs, while others appear to navigate these waters with relative ease? Well, it might surprise you to learn that the difference often lies not in the funds themselves, but in the approach of the investors. Consider the case of Jane. Jane is an intelligent, hard-working professional with a keen interest in growing her wealth. She hears about the impressive returns of ETFs, and eager to get in on the action, she dives headfirst into the market. But despite her enthusiasm, Jane quickly finds herself floundering. Why? Because she made one of the most common mistakes in ETF investing, failing to understand what she was investing in. You see, ETFs are not all created equal. Some track broad market indexes, while others focus on specific sectors or commodities. Jane, in her haste, invested in a variety of ETFs without fully understanding their underlying assets or the risks associated with them. As a result, her portfolio ended up heavily skewed towards volatile sectors, leading to significant losses when the market took a downturn. Now let's turn our attention to Tom. Like Jane, Tom was attracted to the potential returns of ETFs. However, unlike Jane, Tom took the time to educate himself about ETFs before investing. He understood the importance of diversification and took care to ensure his portfolio was well balanced. When the market did eventually dip, Tom was better protected and managed to weather the storm. But it's not just about understanding the ETFs themselves. Another common mistake is allowing emotions to dictate investment decisions. Consider the case of Sarah. When the market started to fall, Sarah panicked and sold her ETFs, locking in her losses. On the other hand, Mike, who had a clear investment strategy and stayed the course, was able to recover his losses when the market rebounded. So, what can we learn from these stories? First, it's crucial to understand what you're investing in. Don't just jump on the ETF bandwagon without doing your homework. Second, diversify your portfolio to protect against market volatility. And finally, keep your emotions in check. Develop a clear investment strategy and stick to it, even when the market gets tough. In conclusion, successful ETF investing is as much about psychology as it is about financial acumen. By understanding the common mistakes and learning from the experiences of others, you can navigate the world of ETFs with confidence and potentially achieve the financial growth you're seeking. Remember, the key is not just to invest, but to invest wisely.